Hello everyone, welcome back. Another episode here of a Amazon review. Um, today I'm going to be reviewing and a little bit of unboxing, although you can kind of see it. I got it off of Amazon. It's called Erdogan Scholarize Bump Cap. This is the two-pack gray universal bump cap insert made in the USA, I guess. I'll leave a link in the notes. It's an Amazon affiliate link. I do get something out of it, but uh, I bought it with my own money, so this is not a sponsored or endorsed. Well, this is not sponsored by Erdogan or Scholarize, um, but I just want to show you, if you're interested in it, what you get out of it. And I actually like it very much. So um, here's some hats. I, now, most of the hats I get are freebies. So I don't pay for them. But uh, man, this look at the, look at the shape of this hat looks really good. This is the one that I had to cut the bottom of to have it fit because it was just the, the bump cap was a little large. So look at that, nice. If you want to see the inside of it, that's what it looks like on the inside, and it is uh, it really is very nice, very nice. I like it a lot, and it just gives the hat. A nice shape to it. Look at that. Isn't that nice? I'll just put that right here for now. Uh, here's a hat that I bought on Amazon. Uh, basically, this hat folds into this. I got the two. It comes in a pair, uh, high vis yellow and the gray, and it has piping around. It has piping all around. That's why I got it. But you can see it doesn't really hold shape. And when I originally got this, um, and I'll leave links for these as well. This I got off Am this I got off Amazon. This I got free for buying a Glock. Uh, made a video on that a long time ago. This is, uh, this is another hat. I will put the uh, bump cap into this hat. But my wife goes to conventions and she gets a lot of this stuff. She's in the, her company's in the oil and gas industry. So. They give her a lot of freebie stuff. So this I got off Amazon, and it's a um, just a foldable hat and high vis with piping on the edge. You see, it folds, it folds here, and it comes out like this. The problem I was having was, um, you see, it has it holds no shape, and um, it was really loose on my head. Uh, that's the other thing, really loose on my head. And even though if I tighten this up, it would still be very loose. Um, Although I, I do like it for its portability. So I do like it for its portability. But I will uh, put an insert in this as well to give you an idea of what it's, what it's like. So um, that just kind of gives you an idea of the hats that I have. So let's, uh, let's start with the unboxing here first. Let's uh, put this over here. And, uh, and again, these are the inserts. You can just cut them. But let's just open this up and give you what what it looks like, a better detail of what it looks like. So I liked it so much I bought another pair. And I think they're like uh, almost, they're about a little bit over $5 each. This is a two-pack, two, two pack, so $10. Um, not bad, not bad at all. And it, it's just plastic, you know. It's, it's, it's flexible enough to fit inside the hat but once you put it in the hat and once it it has that shape it really has some good structure to it now is this a helmet for riding a motorcycle or um, maybe a bicycle I don't think so uh, I wouldn't even I don't know <laughs> even for riding a skateboard I, I don't know uh, is it good to have this in your hat if you're doing some work underneath a car yeah if you are working in a tight space yeah it's a bump cap okay so it will I, I do believe it will help in protecting your noggin your head for a bump <laughs> okay a bump uh, this is not gonna like this is not a motorcycle helmet in any way shape or form okay so there is some padding here and it does say, I don't know if you can see that, maybe you can. It does say er, Ergodyne. Ergodyne, that's the company. There's a warning sign. 
not industrial safety helmet. See that? Well, it says here, not industrial safety helmet, okay? So uh, it's only one size, okay? So there you go. All right, so now I'm going to go ahead and uh, put it into this. And uh, yeah, like here, here's the parts. So if if the if this doesn't fit in, into your hat, you can cut you can cut the edges right here. It's already lined, as you see. There's some grooves here. Uh, you could maybe even bend it and then peel it off. Um, but I use just use a scissor. That'd be a lot easier. And just cut. So okay. So let's see if I can do this on camera. Give myself some room. So this is the foldable hat, and you see this has no structure whatsoever. Uh, it's lightweight and everything. And keep in mind that this, this hat right here is the same hat. It's just a different color. So if you look at this hat, it's really nice shaped. Look at that. And when I put it on, it, it adds a little bit of weight, but when I put it on my head, it actually stays on my head, even though there's a little wind blowing. That was the issue with this hat. Um, a little bit of wind, it would just fly off my head. This is what it looks like on the inside. And this one, I did not, I did not cut the edges, so it is a little tight. It is very tight. It does stick out. It has a wider back out here, so you can see that, see this. But I'm going to leave that. This is mainly to uh, stretch it out and give it shape. So, so let's uh, put it in here. Put it in this one. See how long it takes. See, once you put it in, it really gives it. I mean, it's it really gives it some shape. And put it under your sweatband. Now this is going to be really tight. I already know off the bat because it, it doesn't quite fit 100%. See what I'm talking about? It doesn't quite fit 100%. But if I just kind of just push it in there, it will fit. It does leave some plastic piece showing in the back but I'm okay with that now look at that that gives it a really nice clean shape so look at that nice clean shape to it just a bump cap member but I, I really like it I like it and it does offer some protection it's better than nothing so if you got hit on the head bam you know it would hurt so that's this one here uh, Let's try to, okay, got that one there. Another thing is, uh, you, I don't know if you can see it, but the vent, the venting lines up exactly the venting on the hat on this one anyway. So on this one, it vents up, it lines up with the vents. So there is some vents in the hat or in the, uh, There are some vents in the, uh, obviously, in the uh, bump cap. All right, so let me see if I can, if I can do this without, without cutting the edge. Um, so I don't know if it's going to work or not, but you may, you may have to cut the edge, like I did on some of these. If it doesn't fit really nice and tight, just cut the edges off. see if, how this one fits yeah this one I'm guessing I probably have to cut the edge it's already sticking out it may fit it's stretchy this hat stretches quite a bit on this one you see that it, it hides the, the back here yeah it's a little tight it's a, it's really tight I'm probably gonna have to cut the edge or if I could if I could let it stay here and just let it stretch out that might work as well There we go. Now look at that. See, it just gives a really great shape. And if you wear it and break it in, it probably formed your head really well. There you go. This is this is pretty good. I like it. I like it. So there you go. Bump caps. I give this I would give I would definitely give Ergodyne, scolarized bump caps, two thumbs up. 
two thumbs up, everybody, two thumbs up. It is, um, it makes a difference for me. I like it. If you like it, please consider uh, using the link below. It is an Amazon affiliate link. I did get it off of Amazon. Um, I think it's a great idea, and I, I do I do wear it. I do wear it. And so, um, anyways, uh, this concludes the episode here of my uh, demo and review of the bump cap ergodyne, like scolarize, whatever it is. All right. And if you like this kind of content, please like, share, and subscribe, leave a comment. And also, uh, I will be having a membership. Please consider a membership. You'll get early access to videos, uh, depending on your membership level, shout outs. And for super fans out there, all right, you'll get to uh, do collaborations with me. You'll get to direct or propose or make requests for videos. All right, thanks a lot.